Good morning and a happy new year to you. Before we leap ahead in to 2018 and what the weather has in store for the week ahead, let's just take a quick look back at what 2017 brought us. For Ennerdale in Cumbria on the 15th of May, over six inches of rain in 24 hours. It was a hot day though at Heathrow on the 21st of June, 34 degrees, our hottest day of the year. And in terms of winteriest weather, well, that was Senny Bridge in the Brecon Beacons on the 11th of December with 31 centimetres around a foot of snow. Winter, of course, isn't over by far. A very mobile and rather mild picture overall, though, across the British Isles for the week ahead. You may well have seen a low there to the south, which will get very close to the south coast this New Year's Day. Strong, gusty, maybe even damaging winds along the south coast through the first half of New Year's Day. And quite a bit of rain, too. It becomes a little bit more showery as we get into South Wales. And there should be some sunshine to the north of that before we meet another area of low pressure that's developing across western Scotland and Northern Ireland. That will bring some strong winds through the early part of the day and sink its way into southern Scotland, northern England and continue to feed showers into Northern Ireland through the afternoon. Further south, our other low pulls off into the continent. We should see more in the way of sunshine. Sunshine too for northern Scotland, but a chilly story here, just three degrees in Edinburgh. And then overnight, the showers clear, the isobars open and with clear skies, temperatures are going to dip away significantly uh, for early Tuesday. First day back at work in the new year. Have the ice scraper and the de-icer ready because it looks like we could see a fairly widespread frost. The clear sky is short-lived though. Another area of low pressure swinging its way in from the Atlantic through the day. Rain, some snow for the hills of northern England and the mountains of Scotland. Briefly rather mild though to the far south. Another area of low pressure comes whizzing in overnight Tuesday into Wednesday. Very squally winds in association with this low. Windy day across the board on Wednesday and some heavy and thundery showers possible too. Temperatures typically around average for the time of year, somewhere between the 6 to 10 degree mark. Perhaps a little bit chilly again first thing on Thursday as the winds fall light during the small hours of Wednesday into Thursday, small hours of Thursday I should say, but into the day another area of low pressure coming into the south and west, some more heavy rain and a risk by then of localised flooding. A windy and wet start to 2018.